Hi, I'm Cale from Melling. Thanks for clicking. Today we will review the proper procedure to replace valve springs both on car and with a cylinder head removed. There are many different types of valve spring compressing tools available. We will be using the C-clamp type for the off-car replacement and the screw-down type for the on-car replacement. We will start with the on-car procedure. This will require an adapter hose which goes into the spark plug hole and attaches to the air hose from your air compressor. First, remove the rocker arms. Now install the hose into the spark plug hole. Next, attach the air hose from your compressor. Make sure the compressor is on. Loss of air pressure will allow the valve to fall into the cylinder, making cylinder head removal necessary. Now, install the valve spring compressor onto the spring and tighten until the valve keepers are exposed enough to remove. Remove the keepers with a magnet. Remove the spring and spring retainer. Compress the new spring with a valve spring compressor and install the new spring and retainer. Install the keepers. I like to use a little Mel Lube to hold the keepers in place until I release the compressor. Once you remove the air pressure from the cylinder, tap the valve tips a couple times with a soft-faced hammer to be sure the keepers are fully seated. Now we will cover the off-car procedure. Line the C-clamp type compressor up with the valve face and the valve spring retainer. Compress the spring and remove the keepers. Now place the new spring and retainer over the valve and use the compressor to compress the spring. Install the keepers using Mel Lube to hold them in place. Once you release the spring, tap the valve tip a couple times with a soft-faced hammer to be sure the keepers are properly seated. Be sure to watch our video on valve replacement. I'm Cale from Melling. Thanks for clicking.